Covering St. John's County right now, the pumpkin patch at a St. Augustine church is officially open after its shipment of pumpkins were delayed. So news for Jack's reporter Jennifer Ruddy is joining us now live outside First United Methodist Church. Jen, the church wasn't even sure if it would get pumpkins this year. Good morning. That's exactly right. I spoke with the youth director here at the church and he says that their shipment of pumpkins was delayed this year because the company told them that there is a national trucking shortage. But if you take a walk with me this way, you can see thousands of pumpkins arrived just in time to celebrate the fall. Hold the pumpkin. Yeah, I'll hold that pumpkin. Three year old River and his mom, Brittany Steen, are picking pumpkins of all sizes. The other one. First United Methodist Church in St. Augustine. Trying to build tradition in the family and get him excited about the fall. I want yellow. The church's annual pumpkin patch is a staple in the community. I like all these like funky ones. So much so that youth director Jace Ginn says its nickname is the Pumpkin Church. You can say First United Methodist and people will be like, I don't know where that is, but if you say the Pumpkin Church, you know, they it's our landmark. So we just adopted it and went with it. But this year, Ginn says their pumpkin delivery was delayed. The company said that there's a national trucking shortage. And so they said because of hurricanes and COVID, they've had trouble getting trucks. And so ours were delayed a week. Um, and we felt lucky to get them because we didn't know if we would or not. But the good news is they did. It was really exciting because we love doing this event. And now roughly 2,500 pumpkins cover the lawn out front of the church. That's almost as tall as you. For kids like River and other families to enjoy this fall season. <laughs> And this pumpkin patch is a fundraiser for the church's children and youth programs. The prices vary depending on the size of the pumpkin. It is open every day from 10 until 7. Jennifer Reddy, Channel 4, The Local Station.